Let's go. Okay. Does not sound like you are. Then you are a bigger fool than I thought. Jin, a word, please. Masako, what's wrong? A man named Kachiwara recruited the men who killed my family. His name is on the list. He lives in this prefecture. That monk knows where, but he won't tell me. Junshin means well. I'll talk to him. Junshin, it's good to see you. And you, Lord Sakai. Lady Masako and I are looking for Kajiwara. You know where he is. She accused him of terrible things. I fear for his life if she finds him. Masako has good reason to believe he recruited the men who killed her family. Hmm. He would never do that. 
He is a humble fisherman, a loving husband and father. I think she is blinded by rage. Jushin, I need to talk to him. As long as it is just talking. Take the road from here to the coast. Kajiwara's hut is on the beach. Well? We'll take the road to the coast. Thank you for your help, monk. Peace be with you, Lady Masako. I can't imagine what you said to Junshin that I didn't. He doesn't even try to hear me. It's like talking to a stone. I think he's afraid of you. Afraid? Why? You can be intimidating. In our world, that is not a bad thing. We are hunting a cruel and vicious man. He was a retainer for our clan. Dependable and skilled, but quick to anger. We excused his behavior until the day I caught him beating his wife and daughter. The coward. Hurting his own family. I dismissed him immediately. I offered his wife and daughter refuge in our house. Within a day, they'd gone back to him. It's not always easy, especially when you think they'll change. This path should take us to the beach. We'll leave the horses to avoid being seen. We should approach with caution. I don't want to put Kajiwara's family at risk. That must be Kajiwara's fishing hut. The Mongols found it. They may have already killed him and his family. There's a chance they're still alive. Let's go. Check the house for Kajiwara and his family. This blade is covered in blood. It doesn't look like a Mongol weapon. It's a fisherman's tool. This must be Kajiwara's wife and daughter. I always feared this would be their fate. Maybe the Mongols killed them? Then where is Kajiwara's body? New rolls of cloth. Not cloth. Silk. 
more than a humble fisherman could afford. Masako, footprints. Leading away from the hut. What if Kajiwara survived? Ran like a coward. Let's follow the footprints. Kajiwara! Lady Masako! The Mongols attacked! My wife and daughter! Quiet, snake! We know you killed them. Out of love. Better me than the Mongols. It's what they wanted. You sick Jin! You recruited the assassins who killed my family! Who hired you? Tell me and I will end you lovingly, like you did your wife and daughter. All I know is, he understood. Understood what? How it feels to be ruined by you. How I was driven to poverty. The toll it took on my family. How I couldn't stand to hear another word. Everything you said was a lie. Except about being ruined by me. I know Sadao felt the same way. The conspirators are bonded by hate. The attack on your clan was personal. Organized by a rival samurai with a deep grudge. But I can't think of who. We'll find him. We still have business in Toyotama. I'll find you when I know more. Thank you for your help, Jin. Mm-hmm. 
Not apologies. Perhaps a form. Perhaps. Lord Sakai. I am worried about her. Junshin. What was that about? Lady Masako is looking for someone. She is angry I couldn't help. Like you helped with Kajiwara the fisherman? Did you ever find him? Yes. After he killed his wife and daughter. How could I be so foolish? My friend can be harsh, but she speaks the truth. This time, I truly do not know who she's after. You have nothing to fear. I'll speak with her. Thank you, Lord Sakai. And also for ridding this farmstead of Mongols. Now we can rebuild. These people are lucky to have you. Be well. Did the farmers know who you're looking for? Someone on the list. A thief. I'll help you find them. I need to handle it myself. The farmer said they left with armed men. Mercenaries. Professional killers. They could complicate things. I can use your help, but I need your discretion. You can count on it. The farmers said they went toward the bridge outside the farmstead. It's this way. Hey Who is this thief? He looted Clan Adachi's estate after the attack. Stole valuable heirlooms, personal items. What makes it worse is that Mai was our former servant. Three years ago, my husband caught her stealing. He wanted to have her flogged. I did what I could for her, but she had to go. It almost sounds like you miss her. She was a dear friend. Her betrayal stings more than the others. to sell everything. I'm just waiting for the right time. Too late. He'll sell those heirlooms himself. Now take us to them. I'll pay you to leave them with me. <laughs> you have no money. I have this comb. It's gold with pearl inlay. That was a gift. It might fetch a fair price. No. It'd have our heads. Enough of this. Take us to the heirlooms. We don't need the mercenaries alive for questioning. Just her. The more of them we eliminate, the easier it'll be to recover what's yours. Just don't be seen, or they might hurt her.
distracted. I'll take him. How far is your hiding spot? A fair distance. I'll tell your story to pass the time. Once there was a girl. Her eyes were hard and had no cutter. One day, a monk from far away came to the tea house, and the two fell instantly in love. knows that magic. We all do. The girl flew as a demon to the monk's monastery. But the monk saw the demon hidden under the bell. She was clever and cast fire around the bell, melting and killing the monk inside. Her dog had followed us! Kill them! to speak with Mai. I'm here if you need me. You stole my family's heirlooms for those murderers. How could you betray me? I didn't. You betrayed me. Turn me away. I saved you. My husband wanted you flogged. He knew. Then you should have left with me. I was the lady of Clan Adachi, and you were a thief. I still love you. Then tell me who you serve. He killed my family. And he'll kill me. I won't let him touch you. I'll take you to your family's things. We know the man you work for is a samurai. I don't know his name. Never saw his face. He communicated only through notes. He knew about us, my lady. How? I don't know. He said he knew what it was like to love you. That he understood my pain. Masako. My was my only... Has been the only people anxious about the heirlooms. Concerned they get broken. He's eager to sell them. Their value is purely sentimental. He won't get the money he seeks. Then perhaps he has no intention of selling. It's possible they're personal to him too. He was possessive in his notes. Spoke as if they were his. The heirlooms belong to no one but my family. I am the only one who remains.
Your heirlooms are in the brush. Jin, will you gather them? I need to say goodbye. You are going to say goodbye. Thank you. Where's Mai? She's gone home. Jin, I want you to know, I'm not... You don't owe me an explanation. I cared for my husband. But I cared for Mai, too. You still do? I think I always will. The man we hunt has feelings for you. Other than my husband and my, I've had no romances, no admirers. He could have been lying, feigning sympathy to gather recruits. I just don't know who would do that. We'll keep searching. It's only a matter of time. My work in Toyotama isn't finished. Meet me when you can. Sit. 